anything else, I'm just gonna get it hung too. Soft plastics on. Uh, oh man! <laughs> Small <laughs> mouth. <laughs> uh, turned around and then he tricked him again. All right, Will got on the first fish of the day. A little smallmouth. We he he came up and pecked at it and turned around and then no, it's a spotted. Weird. It's just a brown color. That was funny. <laughs> Hell yeah. Of course, it could be too snaggy back here, too. There's actually a lot of current coming through. Oh, it's because it circles back there. It ain't really coming through there. Oh, I know that was, this is full of crappie. Boy, it's the closest close could have gotten right there. <laughs> There's got to be something, but I'm almost scared to let my lure fall is the problem. The water does come through there. I was wondering why there was so much current. Way more than I thought. Looked dead from far away. Oh, Will's on a nice one here, guys. Yeah. Oh man, nice spotted bass on a like a two inch curly tail with a some kind of weird darter head thing. He's not bad. Yeah. Two to zero. Yep. I'm keeping score today. Mmm. I gotta do something then. I knew there would be something sitting back in here though. Something told me to get over here. My first fish of the day, a little spotted bass on the Bandit 300 Shad. Tennessee Shad, I think's the color. And it's a good crankbait for here. Little guy, about nine inches. Yeah, he was just so small, I thought, it, I, thought I was hitting the sand. Well, this crankbait's gonna work after all. You got one? Man, we're on them today, guys. Yeah. Man, we've caught five fish, guys, in a half an hour. We've only really fished 10 minutes. He was a pound at least, I guess. About to get sucked out. Oh yeah, there he was. There he is. I think he's on there, he's just small. Oh, he's fighting now. I wish I could get a white bass again, man. That blew my mind. Cause there's not many in here. That was the second one ever. The first one was way down by Corning. All right guys, second spotted bass of the day for me. Six fish total between the both of us. One small mouth and five spots. Hoping to get a real large mouth someday. Some decade. Really, you're gonna do me like that. You're gonna force me to use pliers. You little prick. I'm trying to steer the boat and you're making me use pliers. I got those fancy $13 Academy pliers. Yeah, I bought I bought another pack up, another one. Every time I try to take the hooks off, it cuts the hook. They cut it. It destroys them. I said, the hell with them things, little guy, guys. I don't know why though. It don't. You would look at him and go, I don't think it's gonna do that, but it does. I've already been plotting to take it over there to Eminence, though. And, oh, yeah! On the orange swim bait. Yeah. Walleye! Oh, get it, get it, get it, get it. It's fishing. Oh, yes! All right, guys, we're officially going to have a good day. This overcast weather, it's getting close to the full moon again. It's close. we got to see if it's 15, because I'm eating a bit better. 
I caught him on, I'm going to have to have pliers, a orange and silver Lunker City Shaker swim bait with a VMC Moon Eye Fire Tiger quarter ounce jig head. In a spot where I wouldn't have thought a wall I'd be right now. I don't think he's 15. Let's see, 13. About 15. 13. Nice little walleye guy. Start to a promising day. Man, they're hitting that little swim bait. That's cool. He's in a shallow hole for them. All right, guys. Hey, not gonna complain. Heck yeah, man. I, each trip I've come here, we've gotten one every time we've come this year. Since June. We came, what was that? No, we came 4th of July, caught two. Then we came three or four weeks ago, about four weeks ago, caught two more or three more. Why are they missing the hook? This is where she caught her big goggle eye right here. He was a nine or ten incher. If you just sat here and fished with a worm right below, you'd probably get one. I've got one. Yep. How did I not get hit right there is beyond me. Maybe I should try the orange thing again. I know they're right back in that little crevice. Just letting it glide. Seeing how deep it is. All right, Will's on something nice here, guys. Nice small mouth. I'm gonna zoom in on you holding this one. We gotta start getting some good pictures. Lucky dog, man. He caught him on an orange ringworm. Like a three inch ringworm. He's not a bad guy, he's a, he's a pound, 12 incher. Heck yeah, we're getting them guys today, it's today. And if it don't rain this week, me and her's gonna come back here next Saturday on the full moon, what we're hoping. I don't know how we escaped all these rains. They keep saying two, three inches and it disappears. I knew there'd be a small mouth in this hole though. Something told me. Anyone that's got them big rocks like this. Huh. Oh, I got hit. There he is. Oh, I got a nice one, whatever this is, man. Real nice. I think it might be the way it's fighting. Oh my God. What is this? My God. I don't know, man. This is no small fish. It could be a big small mouth. I got a big one here last year. Oh! What was it? I don't know, it was that long. It was everything. I had him all the way to the bank! God! How the hell did that just happen? He, did, he didn't even break the line, it just popped. That had to be a walleye. Oh my God. There we go. Oh man. All right, guys. Spotted, but it's a decent. Oh, Will's on something. Two at the same time. Ah, uh, that's what's stealing your worms. All right, we got doubles, guys. You got a channel cat, which brings us to five species now. And uh, yeah, because we got spotted smallmouth and largemouth and walleye and catfish. 
and then I caught a nice spotted bass here. Still sad over what losing that big mystery fish though. That thing was a giant. Whatever I had was a giant. And I know I'll never have a chance at a big one like that again today. I believe it was a walleye, I really do. And I think it was at least mid-20s, 24. It was that long. So it may have been bigger than what I'm thinking. It could have been seven, eight pounds. God. It was good, whatever it was, it was good size. There we go. Oh, yes! Yes! You said you had a goggle eye? I, I thought that's what that Oh, was. here we go. He's hitting a three inch. This is 3.25 inches. That's ridiculous. Yeah, that means yeah. they're biting good then. That's probably why you kept losing them a minute ago. Yeah. All right, guys. Nice little eight or nine inch black crappie. I'm not going to complain. We're catching everything then. Bad little crappie. They always want to curl their tail when I'm trying to get a thumbnail of it. Every time. Caught him on the Lunker City Shaker. Three inch orange. Looks like orange is the color today, guys. I'll take these all day as long as they're this size and bigger. Not bad. A little black crappie. Fix that up when we get to the spring. Got a crappie. Man. So he's right by the bank. I'm gonna try the pink pulsar. My god. It's usually better than this back in here. Mm. Oh you got a crappie. It's a big one. God, that's a nice one. All right, we got the biggest crappie of the day, guys. He's probably 11 or 12. Let, yeah, 10. Not a bad one, though. You got him on a jig and cork. Yeah, I thought you were hung. I thought you went in that branch. Man, sucks with no sunlight. It just looks real pale white. Well, I mean, that's pretty pale anyway. Yeah. It's a nice crappie though. Alright. Man, we still did good no matter what I guess. Yeah, your thing your tactics working better than mine. So these jigs are freaking amazing dude. I don't know if you've ever tried them or are they hair? No. That's uh, rubber? Yeah, they're rubber. Yum. Oh. Yum something. Huh. But they're black and pink. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, he was... They're like a beaver tail. He was right... In, damn, another one. There's buffalo back in there. It's got to be. Crappie. Yes. Bass. Bass. Four-pound line. <laughs> got to be careful. Their teeth alone will freaking cut that line. Or the grooves on their lip. All right, guys. I got a real large mouth. Oh, my first real large mouth of the day. On a blue ice Bobby Garland. I've been getting hit by crappie, so he was a disappointment. Especially one that size, anyway. I don't think I can get much of bigger bass on this line, though. I'm really finessing it. Ah, if it's on there, it's tiny. Large mouth. No, 
spotted. Uh huh. It's a spotted bass with snail larvae all over it. It's got the little black dots. You wouldn't think in this river where it's not stagnant at all. Sure does, got them all over his fins. Fish jump, I guess. All right, guys, my second walleye of the day, another small one, but boy, he was barely on there too. It's in front of that little rut. And I let this thing fall all the way, it's on that orange swim bait again. And I let this thing fall all the way to the bottom. I kept saying, man, I sure do see a lot of activity. There may be more than one. It's got the same problem, the little turd again, huh. hanging out. It's a pure walleye, about 13 inches. All right, hey guys, two of them in a day. Let's motor back up there, don't you think? Maybe I'll get one. Yeah. You still got that uh, tangerine thing? Oh, you ain't got one on. All right, Will got a goggle eye. Now they're kind of bite. That's what I'm missing, maybe. I'm gonna zoom in on you on that one. Now we're getting. We got a good variety today. Just no real giants yet, and not really good numbers either. Heck yeah, man. Hey, a bad one, I guess. Six. That's what was pecking at my thing. I bet you're not getting on. I told you I always get goggle eye here. And I probably just, that may have been what I just missed again last cast. Uh -huh. I can't get the thing out. It's stuck. All right. All right, I'll get it. Oh man, you got a nice one, Matt. Man, guys, I literally just told Will this is a walleye potential hole. What does he do? That thing wasn't even deep, was it? I, I literally just hit the water. Hit it. That's Will's personal best walleye. He's easily 20, 20 or 21. Uh, I guess making an attempt is holding him kind of low. And definitely to, over the center of the canoe. Yeah, he's trying to cut the shit out of my face. Mm, flaring his gills. Yeah. Oh, man. That's a nice one. All right, try to take your hand off his tail. There you go. Man, I'll get you a good picture tonight. My art just warned me if I get close to something. That's his personal best, isn't it? Pretty That's sure. Close. My God, made it worth coming anyway. You want to measure it? I want to say 20. I guess just lay him right here real quick. Oh boy. I get his tail up there. No, 18 and... 18, he sure seems bigger than that. They're fatter in this river than the one back home is the thing. They're real thin in that place. Oh my God, look at this. Look at this. It made it worth coming right now, though, just for that one fish. Yeah, because it it's overcast the whole day. I'm thinking that's the reason. I threw it in the brush. He was in the brush. Yeah, and, I was and it, you didn't even, like, let it fall, really, or nothing. I was going for a bass. God. They're definitely right here, no doubt in my mind. Yes! I got a walleye. It's a nice one too. Right. Oh. Oh yeah. Yes it is. He's he's smaller than yours though. It's small. Oh shit, sorry. Alright. Still big enough to eat. Yeah. That's four walleye in one day. Maybe we should just stay here. No, I better get down. We'll get down to that one. I have more faith in that one than this one. Hey, the crankbait works. I can rule it out now that it works. I guess I'll have you. I get this out so I don't flip. Yeah, then I'll have you hold the camera and zoom on me for a minute. We're kind of setting sort of still. 
It's got plenty of battery still. Okay. Oh. All right, guys. Well, Will's beating me size-wise, but I've caught three to his one, and he's caught more crappie than me, and definitely more bass than me. This is the best walleye day me and him have had together. In fact, he's about 16. I'm going to say 16, what do you think? 15 or 16? Yeah, probably, yeah, close. It has to be 15 to keep. We'll measure it out. All right. Okay, tape measure. Oh, he's 15. Right at 15. Ooh. Yep. Oh, man. That was a big one again. All right. Crappie. I knew there was something over here. He's a nice one, too, isn't it? That's the biggest one yet. Really? Well, let me film you here. <laughs> Get a good photo of you. Right when I said, hey, can't even give us one last fish to go out with a bang at the end, and yeah, he's a nice one. Right. Hell yeah, man. I got four minutes on my camera. It'll shut off, so that's four more minutes for us, I guess, because I don't feel like putting a new battery in. I knew there'd be something back here. Something just told me with all the trees I'm seeing in the calm water. There he is. Yep. Another one. All right, guys. Yes. I got me one last fish to go out with a bang on. And he hit a two and a half inch pulsar, so it's a good sign. Nice black crappie. It has a good average in this river. Pretty good yeah. All right. You want him? Yep. I don't know what to do with it. Just throw it right here. Oh, shit. Every time I hook a fish on one of this, it just totally screws it up. There we go. I was honestly about to throw the Bobby Garland. I'm like, well, see if they'll hit this. Sure enough. Hit that one. It's a lot easier for them to find it. As long as the wind ain't blowing, shit, you could hammer them back here. Just hopping around from limb to limb. There we go. Yep, another good one. Little. I think mean, that little. No, it's not bad. Blue ice Bobby Garland, guys. Blue Ice Bobby Garland, BMC Pink and Yellow Head, another black crappie. You want it? I uh, throw that one back. I don't want to get home at nine o'clock and have to clean a whole bunch of fish. No. Unless they're big. That ends our day. All in all, we didn't do bad. We caught those four crappie at the end. That really helped. We caught four walleye. I think eight crappie all together. He caught a goggle eye, a couple little channel cats. I had the mystery fish that's gonna haunt me the rest of my life. That I think's a walleye and it was the biggest one I've ever had hooked. And we probably caught 10 bass total, just only two or three of them were over a pound. Bunch of dinks. But the walleye made it worth it and the crappie made it worth it. Till next time, you know what to do. Alright. Man, them are worse than pickerel, man. I got some sharp little twofers. Man, I'll do two crappies. At least we get good photos that way. 
you ought to too. I'll try to do you. And, you know. Which one's the big? This is the biggest one. <laughs> Stop it! There we go. Yeah. It's good. <laughs> 